Welcome back to Notre Dame Day. I'm Trisha Hart, and here with us now is Father Jerry Olinger, who serves as Vice President for Mission Engagement and Church Affairs at the University of Notre Dame. In this role, which he began in August of 2018, Father Jerry stewards Notre Dame's Catholic and Holy Cross mission and is the university's liaison to the Congregation of Holy Cross, the U.S. Bishops, the Holy See. Father Jerry, welcome to Notre Dame Day. Thank you, Trisha. Great to be here. Well, we're very happy to have you here. You've held several vice presidencies before at the university. University of Portland before you came to Notre Dame last year, uh, but you're no stranger. We were talking about this before. You are actually one of the rare triple domers. <laughs> That's uh, correct. So how's, how do you, how'd you get hooked so much? What's with the three, three degrees? I think like so many people, uh, football was the initial uh, attraction to Notre Dame. I grew up as a Notre Dame fan, though no one in my family had actually gone to Notre Dame, uh, but I had a chance to visit and obviously love the spirit and traditions of Notre Dame, but also got to see the academic excellence mm -hmm. and really the faith formation that happened here. So, so we want to get to your new role as vice president of mission engagement and church affairs. What are you hoping to accomplish? Yeah, so it's a very interesting role. It has a, an internal and an external component. So internally, I really helped the university think about our Catholic and Holy Cross tradition. How do we deepen and strengthen that? And so I'm really excited to work across the university with faculty, with staff, with students, and really thinking about how we do that and how we do that well. And I think some people may be hearing about the Grotto Network, a relatively new initiative. Describe its content and how people can interact with some of these initiatives going on with that. Absolutely. So the Grotto Network was launched about a year ago. It's really trying to think about how do we increase faith practice among young people? Uh, we know the reality of the trends of people not going to mass in as high a percentage. And so it's really thinking about how do we engage young people? How do we help them to think about faith? Um, and how do we connect them into parish communities or other faith opportunities? So it's really all about uh, digital storytelling, video, uh, online content, dynamic content that really engages people and then connects them into communities of faith. And they are beautiful. I mean, some of the pieces that have been done so far are just truly incredible stories that I think help people kind of connect and feel that. So some are what, what are some of the other initiatives that your office is hoping to cultivate in terms of getting people to get more in touch with their Catholic faith? Absolutely. One of the things I'm very excited about is the Notre Dame Newman Center for Faith and Reason. It's based in Dublin, and uh, Cardinal Newman founded uh, a church as well as University College Dublin, um, right in the center of Dublin. And the Archbishop of Dublin has invited Notre Dame to come and staff that church and really to engage young professionals, young people in questions of faith, um, just realizing that there are questions that people have um, and sort of that deepest longing in their lives. And how can we begin to speak into that? And so through really good liturgies, beautiful music, preaching, but as well as intellectual engagement, it's really an opportunity to invite people back into church. And so we have uh, Father Bill Daly, Steve Warner, who was formerly the director of the full choir here at Notre Dame, as well as an entire team there that really engages people in uh, questions of faith in Dublin. Well, Father Jerry, thank you so much for being able to join us here on Notre Dame Day.